Hello and welcome again on Esua Kago YouTube channel. I hope God has kept you safe and you are wearing your mask wherever you are. And for those who can be able to access the vaccination, I hope you are going for it because we need to keep ourselves safe. So, um, today's topic it is a question that I've been seeing so much on my DM and I said to myself why don't I just cover a video that will respond to each and every person and even more people who haven't been able to DM me but they have the same question but maybe they are those we call silent followers maybe they have the question but they cannot be able to ask me so let's keep on subscribing and sharing with people so that they can get the right information right here it's gonna be very fresh and hot from Esuakago youtube channel so there is this thing people asking me so i want to participate i want to play green card but my husband is not willing to do it together and we do have kids and how do i go about this what will happen if i win and my husband refused to join us when we were playing green card and he even restricted his information to be put in when we were playing green card this could be a husband question saying the wife refused because people do have rights to participate in whatever they want and to decline to participate in a thing so i do understand uh, even though you could be a family you are a couple it might be your partner is of other opinion other than trying the lottery thing and as long as you cannot force them please be advised if you play green card you 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 are needed to fill the names the the names or the info that is found on the birth certificate of your kids yourself and your husband so if the husband doesn't want to participate and you did you filled the info of your babies of your kids and the birth certificate reads his name it has his name it might be very difficult because they will need him to give a consent of you exiting your country with his kids or if it is a man the woman will not allow you to exit with the babies so either you will end up coming just yourself or you will have to make peace with the hubby or with the wife find a way of discussing it and come to an agreement whether this pa this person needs you to want you to go to another country with the kids or not be advised the embassy will require the other person to consent so you might have gotten the green card you win but this could make your babies to be left at your home country unless you get to agree with your hubby with your wife if they do not want to come they will have to let you come with their kids if they say no it is a no there is no way you're gonna bring someone's babies someone's kids to a foreign country without their consent so my people just be advised before even you go to play green card because um this might delay you to come here if you are not able to get the consent um as soon as it's needed or before you go for the interview because they will ask you they will ask you your baby have the last name as this and the birth certificate it has the dad's name 
has the dad consented on them being away from him so here you will have if the dad consents if you talk with the dad and you agree yes you can have them you can live with them then you will have to have his consent avi david and yeah something written and signed by him and maybe they might require him to be there physically to consent you because sometimes an affidavit can be done by just anyone and a signature can just be put by anyone anywhere and it won't uh, show that is not an that is not enough show that or evidence that that is that the man agreed and this is his signature because remember they don't know his signature because so any signature could be said to be his so this is very serious america they do value families so they do not work against or they do not work towards breaking families and when you are coming with your babies you are separating them from the dad and they do not encourage that even here in america if you separate with your wife if you separate with your husband you still have access to your babies you will still have access to your children nobody is allowed to prevent the other person from um, accessing their kids so separation is not that easy as people might think somehow it affects the babies the kids get so much affected but sometimes we do ignore this fact but it is the fact so just make peace with your spouse and decide if you guys want to participate in the lottery and if you will put the children there and if he will give you the consent at the long last yes so i did this video to make this clear if you do have more questions do not hesitate to get in touch with me i will get in touch with you as soon as i can but yes you do have to agree on the kids whether you're gonna be allowed to come with them or not so do this early enough before you even go to play green card other than rushing the last minute so if your husband doesn't want to come if your wife doesn't have to come just sit down and agree what if i win will you allow me to carry the the kids what if i win will you allow me to carry the kids with me or would you want them to remain with you that being given and again it is very hard if you do not have issues with your husband i do not see the reason why you should just uh, decide to separate because of green card it is always good to sit down and talk and agree on something because as much as we want people to come and try their luck here it is also good to encourage families to live together because uh, at the long last it is all about people who are close to us and our families of course so it is always good to consider them first okay so this is the end of this video and if you have any more question just get in touch with me bye bye and may god keep you safe